Now in order to look at efficiency, I'm just going to do a quick investigation with this tennis ball. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop it from a certain height. So here I've got something which has got 10 equally sized sections. Now if I drop it from the top, it bounces up to about this height, which is kind of sort of five and a half sections high compared to the original 10. Now I could do the investigation again, but using maybe a different kind of ball. So this is a steel one. Okay, that bounced a little bit, maybe up to about there. Uh, I could also, you know, do the same thing with other kinds of balls. I've got a, a bean bag here that doesn't bounce at all. Now, when we come to think about efficiency, it's really just a measure of how much of the energy has been transferred usefully. Now, we're going to say for this example here that the useful energy transfer is the amount of gravitational potential energy stored after its first bounce. Now, it started at 10 sections high. It ended up bouncing to five and a half sections high. So we can then say that this has got either an efficiency of 55%, or also we could give it a number between zero and one, in this case, 0 0.55. And that's all efficiency really is. It's just the ratio of how much energy we had at the start to the amount of energy that's been usefully transferred. So there's two equations we can use. The first one is looking at the amount of energy transferred, and we're thinking about the total amount of energy that goes in compared to the useful amount of energy that comes out. And the other thing we can do is we can look at the power, because power is just the rate of energy transfer, and therefore we can maybe think about uh, the power input to something compared to the power output. And effectively, the more efficient things are, the less wasted energy there is. And again, energy is not created or destroyed, it doesn't disappear. It's just that this wasted energy is often transferred to, the, to a different energy store that's not really useful for what we want that thing to be doing. So that's just a little bit about efficiency.